Okay, so this object, Atlas, or 3i, it's the fastest, oldest interstellar visitor we've ever tracked. And honestly, it's kind of defying physics, forcing astronomers to think about some uh, really wild possibilities, almost sci-fi stuff. First, the science is just weird, suggests maybe artificial control. See, it's blasting out massive amounts of gas, way more carbon dioxide than water, like eight to one. Normally, this gas acts like a mini rocket, pushing things off course. But Atlas, it hasn't deviated at all from its predicted path. That points to two things. Either it's impossibly dense, like billions of metric tons dense, or, well, it's using some kind of internal thrusters to stay put. Second, this weirdness, it connects really well with the idea it's an extraterrestrial probe. Harvard physicist Avi Loeb found its path lines up almost perfectly, like a 0.6% chance it's coincidence, with where that famous unexplained wow radio signal came from back in 77. So is Atlas an intelligent, maybe nuclear-powered probe? Could it be scouting us out after hearing our broadcasts? Loeb's actually watching it from many probes right now. Finally, there's another twist, the returning humans idea. Atlas is coming in really close to our solar system's flat plane, the ecliptic, very deliberate looking. The Hancock hypothesis asks, what if it's not an alien scout, but a ship, carrying descendants of an advanced human civilization that fled Earth maybe 12,000 years ago, and now they're back. Atlas is definitely a cosmic messenger, and when it reappears this December, whether it's some ancient machine or our own lost relatives, it's gonna fundamentally challenge how we see ourselves in the galaxy.